I just want to say a huge congratulations to everyone. I mean, it's it's been very strange. Finishing my degree by pressing send on Moodle while sat in my pyjamas in bed was not really how I envisaged finishing my degree three years ago. Um, my name is Sheila and I'm studying economics. My name is Zed Hussain and I'm studying actuarial science. I'm Sam Rippon and I've been studying the Government and History undergrad programme. Hi, my name's Amani and I study International Social and Public Policy and Economics. What makes LSE so welcoming is the people that make up LSE, not just the faculty but also the departmental contact points. I think there's two ways of looking at it. There's like the institution and then there's the community. For the last two years, I've been president of the Drama Society, and that's probably taken up most of my time at LSE. I think some people have said I've been doing a, a theatre degree rather than uh, government and history, um, but that's that's where I've spent most of my time meeting people. Joining the African Caribbean Society, I really enjoyed embracing my culture um, and finding so many people who would accept our culture on campus. So I think that was my main highlight, just knowing that I was at a university that embraced so many different cultures. I would say being part of Charity Week in uh, 2017 was amazing. As a group, we collectively raised a large amount of money for charity, which was something that I've never done before. I obviously have been grateful to receive lots of um, lots of good academic support with some very high profile academics in my field but I think what makes me feel part of LSE and the community there is, is the people I've met through uh, through societies and through um, the courses I've undertaken. The people make LSE in my opinion. I will cherish these memories for possibly the rest of my life. The one thing I'm really going to miss is being in London and having so many opportunities there because I grew up in a really small village. Um, so coming to London was a huge change. It was really, really different. LSE has made me um, a more confident person. Uh, it surrounded me with lots of uh, different people, people that I wouldn't normally have met um, up, up in the north of England. It's made me confident, not just in academic, terms in like stating opinions um, but has made me confident in terms of uh, addressing other people um, in speaking to people from lots of different communities which I'd never uh, met before um, and I think that's that's what I'll take away mostly in terms of the impact it's had on on me. I've never had to speak in front of a large audience as much as I have at university which is something which is which was scary at first but then I started to welcome it which is something that I never thought I'd get out of LSE. One word I'd definitely use is um, international, because um, that's one thing I really like about LSE and the people I've met here. It was fun-loving, it was academically rigorous. I'd say challenging, I'd say fun, embracing. Memorable. To my professors, thank you very much for all the knowledge that you've given us and I uh, hope we can see each other soon after Corona. I would definitely say hey to my academic advisor. Her name's Anne Power and she works in the housing department. She has been fantastic. The whole three years that I've been at uni, she has coached me academically, personally, and I honestly cannot thank her enough for the amount of support she's put into helping me through uni, helping me with my dissertation. I, I can't even put it into words. I'm so, so grateful. Uh, to the fellow students, I would say well done. And um, I know it's not been easy uh, grinding at LSE. Although we won't have the big graduation ceremony that everybody in my year will attend. It doesn't take away from the fact that most of the three years uh, we had and most of the degree I was going to go through um, was undertaken successfully. Words of wisdom to people who are graduating would be to remember where you've come from and recognise how hard you've worked and what you've been able to achieve. Three years is a long time and we all put our heart, our soul, into our academics, into making the time in London so fulfilling, into making memories along the way. You know, it is, it is us that are making the change. It's no longer our parents or our elders. It's going to be us. Thank you for making it um, an enjoyable and um, enriching three years, um, whether it's friends or academics. Probably everybody's had a little impact 
on my time and other people's time here. I'm so proud of everyone. Everyone should be so proud of themselves and um, no matter what we go into in our next chapter in life, I'm sure everyone would do amazingly well.